Acetum burrito. Acetum. She's tired. So I tried to be productive this morning. I am honestly just not feeling like it today. I feel kind of drained. I think that some days that's okay. So I was gonna try to do a bunch of stuff today to distract myself. But instead, I'm thinking that this day is gonna be more of a little self-care day. I'm trying to think of some ideas. I might do my nails. Me and mom are gonna go to the graveyard later. I'm gonna cook a little bit. Maybe take a nap, read some books. That could be good for me. I don't know, sometimes I just have a hard time doing self-care. Like I can tell other people how to do self-care, but myself, I'm like, no, I don't deserve time for myself. I think it's important to realize that. This little pup definitely helps me. I guess that's how my day's going. My day's already getting a little better. It's Monday morning and my Discover Weekly is popping this week. So lots of good songs. I'm so excited to listen to all these. Does that make anybody else's week 10 times better or is that just me? I actually look forward to Fridays and Mondays just so that I can listen to my new music. what I want to do today. I'm kind of in a little bit of a funk today marks two years since my dad passed away so it's always kind of a tough day for me and my family but we're gonna go visit my dad later today. If anybody else has lost a parent I absolutely feel for you is a tough thing to do but it does get easier. You'll always miss him but I think that as the time goes on, I find more and more ways that he's still in our lives. Like for instance, my little sister's temper. <laughs> Every time that Bailey has an outburst, me and mom are like, oh, there's dad. And then Wendy, our little dog, her snores more than anything. My dad used to snore so loud that it would keep us all up. Now Wendy, she snores so loud, you wouldn't believe it for a freaking five pound dog. It's just in those little things that reminds me that he's still here and looking over us. This lighting is absolutely terrible, but Wendy with me went for a little drive to pick mom up. It's her lunch break. So we're gonna go for a little walk. I did a few applications this morning, so that helped a little bit, but it's good to get outside the house and get a little fresh air. We're gonna go for a walk with mom. Wendy had her head out the window driving here. She loves it. She loves sticking her head out the window in the wind. But this guy's walking by me and he's thinking I'm weird. Hello. So that I could have the dog. Oh, <laughs> unfortunately, no. <laughs> She's mine. <laughs> that guy just asked for Wendy. I am not sure how to. don't drink water. I'll have my two cups of coffee in the morning. I should have one regular coffee and one decaf and then for some reason my mind is like no more fluids today. Maybe a glass of wine but we don't want water. Now that I think about it that is probably not contributing to me feeling that good. 
I did drink my one glass of water this morning. I'm trying to get in the habit of those three things. But I'm making my bed, praying, and drinking my water, so. Mm. I came back from my walk today, and I just finished that. I listened to Emma Chamberlain's new podcast. It's actually a funny story. She was saying that she had a breakdown recently because she tried to upload her podcast to her editor and there was nothing there. It basically like didn't film. And she said that she just had a full on meltdown. I honestly, I appreciate when people are so honest and open about not having a good day. I'm trying to do the same thing, but I just completely wholeheartedly related to that. So I definitely needed that reminder today. Not everybody has good days all the time. We all have bad days. But my little sister, she is actually doing the best out of all of us, me, my mom, and my sister. She said that, this might sound silly, but I always look for little signs that my dad is watching over me and, you know, that his spirit is kind of still here, that his angel's watching. And if you don't believe in that kind of thing, then that is totally fine, but I do. So I haven't really gotten any signs today, but my little sister said that in her room, her bathroom light started flickering and then stayed on or something like that. And it has never ever done that. I honestly, she said that she thinks it's a sign that it's dad saying that he knows that he just wants us to know that he loves us and that he's watching over us. I really did think it was a sign. So I did need that reminder today. It's Tuesday morning and I am honestly so glad that yesterday is over. For anybody that has lost anybody, you just know that the day that they pass is just, no matter what you do, it's a hard day. So me and my mom went and visited him and everything. We took Wendy. She loves, this sounds so morbid, but she loves walking around the gravesite. And I think dogs, they just know when we go to the grave like she sniffs all around where my dad is and i just think that's special that might be weird but i do think it's special feeling a lot better today emotionally so that's good had a little cry session last night but that's to be expected honestly a bunch of my friends texted me and called me and that definitely helps you know it takes a village i think that's a saying for raising a child or something but it takes a village for anything I think to get over losing somebody or just to get through anything in life we need each other so I think in this age when everybody's so independent that's a great thing but it's also important to have your little community anyways I did my three things already this morning I made my bed which I'm ruining now as we speak and then I also had my glass of water and said my prayers. So today is already looking up. I haven't cried this morning. Baby steps. So I decided to be a little fancy today since yesterday. I literally ate cereal for whole meals. But I decided I'm gonna do a little wrap action. I just opened this avocado, and if that doesn't make your day, I don't know what will. That is just one of the best feelings, when you open an avocado and it's just perfectly ripe. Honestly, I could have waited a little longer for this one to ripen, but I'm impatient. My little sister has been making these breakfast wraps. I don't know if she did it recently, but a little while ago she did so I think I'm gonna try to make like a little breakfast burrito and do a whole wheat wrap with some avocado and some egg and some tomato mmm this is so good I think I'll hit the spot today Here's all of our ingredients that we have. We've got our eggs, we've got our just food line brand wrap, our avocado that we already cleaned out, and then this cheese. I'm struggling. 
struggling so hard trying to do all this with one hand. doesn't look amazing but I've come a long way from my potato days so I'm pretty proud but anyways I went to open a new browser I honestly lost my train of thought because guess what I got Aww. do you see this so cute Honestly, that just makes my day. I love it so much when my little turtle gets goodies. It's like this little Chrome extension, I guess. My little sister showed me how to do it and you can like change the animals, you can change the goodies and like the more you interact with them, I think, you can like pet some of them and they like get all happy or you can like ignore them and they get all sad. Like some don't like to be pet at all. But my little turtle is just decked out now. He's such a little rock star with his piano. I love it. <laughs> We're out getting a bench because mom had to go back and get it. Are you excited? Yes, I am. <laughs> Thank you very much. Here's all the bench we're going to get. Hopefully, we can get it in our door. It's so windy out here. you got to hold on it. Cute. For a little entryway. Yeah, we're freezing. we got to get inside. We came back and we got it little candles too. Mom's getting the bench, but I just love these candles. Love the little detail, the little pattern on the jar. I think it's so cute. But this one, it is unreal. It smells exactly like espresso beans. That's what it is, espresso. And this one, I don't really know what the scent is. Regardless, it smells so good. Definitely recommend. They're like the Aromatique brand. They're so cute. I love them. We can do this. <laughs> Show us your muscles. <laughs> oh gosh. little bench. Wendy's very curious about it. It looks so good though. Their little fall stuff. We were kind of worried it wouldn't fit like this way lengthwise I guess or that it would stick out too far but it looks super cute. I think Wendy likes it too. <laughs> 